Hello, in this short video I'm going to show you how to use Countdown Timer along with PowerPoint. Okay, so before you're going to do this uh, interface to PowerPoint, you're going to change your settings, you'll change your messages, uh, you'll change your uh, colors, fonts, everything that you you want to uh, see that's going to show up in PowerPoint. And then you can test it simply by clicking on the Start Countdown button to see what you're going to get. Okay, so once you're satisfied with the colors and what you're going to work with uh, and the clock time, and by the way, if you are going to use a clock time, you can do that with PowerPoint, but this time here needs to be set to a future time during the day. Okay, so we'll just go with this minutes and seconds. Now click on the PowerPoint menu, save as PowerPoint configuration. So we have five different choices here, A through E. You'll see down here as I click A, B, C, and D, you'll see the bottom here change. We'll go with A. Now, the reason we did this here is you want to use this run command in your PowerPoint presentation. So what I've done is I highlighted this and I pressed Control C or Copy. Now, if I go to my presentation, we'll click here to add a sample title and a subtitle. Okay, now what I want to do is I want to insert a an action. So um, like for example this subtitle I'm going to click on action here and we're going to go to run so when I click on that link when I click on the subtitle I want it now to go to my PowerPoint A presentation. You see I just copy pasted it in so I can I press control V right here and uh, select the run program on mouse click. So you see it turns into a hyperlink. So if I run this we'll go to slideshow and we'll run it. All I have to do is click on the subtitle. Now I'm going to get the security notice message and this is unfortunately something you're going to have to live with. But once we click enable it'll go right to the countdown timer and as it clicks down when it finishes it'll return right back to PowerPoint. There we go, time's up, I'll, I'll press escape and it comes right back to PowerPoint. That's all there is to it. Good luck and uh, thanks for using countdown timer.